Hey, Dr. G here. Thanks for watching this short video. In today's video, I'm going to show you an actual procedure of an epidural injection being done on the low back for a patient with a herniated disc. This can also be done for people that are suffering from herniated discs and sciatica. And the whole purpose of this injection is for pain relief, basically. It's not going to heal a herniated disc. What it does is it brings down inflammation around the nerves that, are, that may be irritating those nerves and causing the pain or pain going down the leg. Now, you may be asking yourself, Doc, why do they do this injection if it doesn't help to heal a herniated disc? Well, the reason is just to get enough pain relief for the patient for them to be able to function. And, and most, most doctors will agree that once that epidural injection starts to help you, then that would be the perfect time to go ahead and start an exercise and rehabilitation program because that's what's going to help you to strengthen your low back and also to heal a disc. So this is what the room looks like. This is a video fluoroscopy machine. It's basically a live x-ray. Uh, it's almost like a video x-ray where the doctor is able to see exactly where he will be applying the injection. And he's able to see that through that screen in the back. So now I'm gonna show you the actual procedure. It's very fast, takes less than a minute, and the patient can go ahead and go on their own without any, any assistance from anybody. During the procedure, the patient will lie down on their stomach with a pillow underneath the pelvis to increase the space in between the vertebrae. Then the doctor will apply alcohol to the skin to sterilize the area, and then he'll apply a local anesthetic to numb the area so that the patient feels very little pain. After that, he will go ahead and apply the injection to the area that's injured and press down on the syringe to apply the medication. And during this procedure, you may feel a little bit of pressure once the medication is going into your body. But once that's done, the doctor will go ahead and pull out the syringe and apply a band-aid to the puncture area so that there's no infection. So there you have it. That's what an epidural injection looks like in the low back for people with herniated discs and sciatica. And I decided to create this video just because I get many questions of people asking me what the procedure is all about, what it looks like. And sometimes people are afraid to get it done just because they don't want an injection going into their spine. But as you, as you can see, it's a fairly simple procedure for the doctor to perform. And you're able to go ahead and get out of the clinic the same day without a problem.